Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Quantum Ideas. So today we will be uh, solving some digital side problems related to absolute value. So let's get started. So number one, the absolute uh, value this is called modulus. Okay, so modulus of n minus 2 is equal to 10. What is the sum of two possible values of n? So if, our, if we are given with something like uh, modulus of x equals to 3, then what we can say that this x can have two values okay this x can have value like minus 3 and it can have value x equals to 3 but if we take the modulus of any number maybe negative or positive it always gives the positive number so we can solve this problem let's say we are given n minus 2 is equal to 10 yeah? this is our question so what we can say we can say that the value of the thing that is n minus 2 inside the modulus n minus 2 can have two value it can be either 10 and this can be either okay sorry uh, this can be either minus 10 okay so just find the value of n so n will be if to go to that side that becomes 10 plus 2 that is 12 okay and 2 if go to that side that become minus 10 plus 2 its value will be minus 8 now these are the two values okay two possible values of n now we have to find their sum that is sum will be equals to what sum will be equals to 12 minus 8 that answer is so 4 is your answer so let's go to number 2 how many different integers value x satisfy okay we are given x plus 6 modulus is less than 3 so modulus of x plus 6 is less than 3 we can use a formula that is modulus of x if it is uh, less than let's say the number a we can expand this in term, uh, in term of inequality like this so minus a is less than x is uh, x is less than a you can write like this so we can also write here in the same pattern here so we can write minus 3 is less than x plus 6 is less than th uh, less than 3 so to make this uh, x alone what we can do we can subtract uh, minus 6 from all sides so minus 3 minus 6 so x plus 6 minus 6 uh, sorry uh, less than 3 minus 6 we get minus 9 is less than this cone so x is less than minus 3 so it is asking how many different integers value right how many different value lies between uh, these uh, interval so what are the values of x that uh, how many numbers okay it is asking how many different means it is asking us numbers so uh, how many numbers first let's find out the numbers so uh, x is between minus 9 to minus 3 that means that can be minus 8 minus 7 minus 6 minus 5 okay minus 5 and minus 4 that means 1 2 3 4 5 so x can have 5 different value is your answer okay in between this interval so you can solve like this so let's go to the next number which of the following could be the graph of y is equal to 2x minus 1 okay in term of modulus okay so how can we find out if you see here y is equals to modulus of 2x minus 1 so what we can say is that uh, modulus is neg uh, never negative right so this cannot be negative that means we have to find out let's say let's look at this equation this equation uh, a uh, it has that y intercept is here so this is simply if you should check out it is like y is equals to 2x minus 1 it look like our uh, equation without modulus okay not a problem now let's uh, check this one if you see here are the negative part so this cannot be our graph because this is absolute value is always positive so let's uh, look at this graph if you see here okay if you see our graph this is y equal to 2x minus 1 this part is negative okay so this part is negative is goes down below the x axis or negative is go to negative y axis so if we take the uh, absolute value of this part it will go like this it is reflect over here and it becomes positive so this is our answer so c is the answer okay the uh, what required graph is c and d cannot be because it has two x intercepts so this cannot be our answer okay let's go to next number a dog a hot dog factory okay let's see a hot dog factory must ensure that its hogs hot dogs are between uh, this length and this length okay this is uh, inches in length if h is the length of a hot dog from this factory 
then which of the following inequalities correctly expresses the associated value of h h is the length of hot dog so what the question is saying is that uh, hot dogs are between the length is uh, this one okay 6 1 by 4 inches is less than h is less than 6 3 over 4 so these are upper limit for the hot dog length this is so this is the lower limit and this is the upper limit okay so we can also convert this into the fraction uh, 6 into 4 plus 1 24 6 for 24 plus 1 is 25 over 4 is less than h is less than 6 for 25 26 26 uh, 6 for 24 25 26 27 so 27 over 4 so we have given that 25 by 4 inch is less than uh, length is less than 25 by 4 uh, 27 by 4 inch okay so the hot dog produce will be uh, within this uh, length okay now we have to convert this into this uh, absolute value equation so how can we do that so the formula for that is that we have to take the uh, modulus then we can write h minus uh, midpoint of this two uh, okay two uh, ints we can do like this 24 over 4 plus 27 over 4 divided by 2 just take average and write absolute value then do less and then what we can say that what is the midpoint of this if we do the average, what we will find out is that it, is, it will be 26 over 4, right? So this will be 26 over 4. That means what we can do is less than, we have to find the distance of these points from the midpoint. Okay. So how we can find that? Just subtract. So 26 over 4 minus 27 over 4. So this will be minus 1 by 4. And we are talking in terms of distance. And distance is always positive. So you can take 1 by 4. So this will be less than 1 by 4. So what we get at minus 26 over 4 is less than 1 by 4. So if I uh, just uh, divide by uh, just divide it by 2, we get 2 to 4, 2, 1, 2, 13, right? This is 13 over 2 is less than 1 over 4. So at minus 2, 6, 2, bell, and this is 1 is less than 1 by 4. So our final answer is this one C, okay? So what we did was that uh, we, we are given let's say a point A which is less than X is less than B. Then we if we have to convert this into the absolute value like uh, these ones what we can do we can do like modulus X minus average of the in point A plus B over 2 and that is less than a distance of what a distance distance always positive okay distance of let's say in point in point from midpoint you have to find out this one okay this is what we used uh, <coughs> let's go to number 5 so we are given absolute value of 2x plus 1 uh, is equals to 5 if a and b are the solution to the equation above what is the value of modulus of a minus b so it is saying that a and b are the two solutions so we already knew that we have already solved this kind of problem what we have to do we have to do copy paste right we have to write 2x plus 1 is equals to 5 and we also can do 2x plus 1 is equals to minus 5 okay now solve it 2x will be if one go to the side 5 minus 1 becomes 4 so x equals to 2 so here also 2x equals to minus 5 minus 1 so 2x will be equals to minus 6 and x is equals to minus 3 so let's say this is a and this is b now we have to find what is the value of absolute value of a minus b now find a minus b so what is a a is 2 minus what is b b is minus 3 and there is a modulus so this is the modulus of 2 minus minus plus okay plus 3 and that is modulus of 5 is 5 so 5 is here answer guys okay thank you for uh, watching my video guys i will be posting more onward so if you uh, like my video please subscribe share okay and comment below so thank you for watching so see you uh, till the next video thank you bye bye